Let's set the scoop and get away north, and the flag is up. Right. With a breath, let's join Gareth Topham. And they're off for this, the Steve Pinky Newland Retirement Novices Handicap Chase. Over one mile, seven and a half furlongs to fence number one of 12 they go with old timer, the red and yellow. Arrow Branco away to the left in the two shades of blue and the favourite, what's the scoop? The dark blue and pink colours as they came over the first. Old timer was right down on his nose but survived as they now head back onto the race course proper and come to the second fence. Bleu et Noir goes keenly on the heels of the leading trio, is up along the inside of the first of the greys, Dakota Grey. Running next is Elixir, who's in light green and black colours, as they shortly will be taking off at fence number three, which is the first of the three open ditches in the race. All safely across it. Elixir is followed towards the back of the field by Hurricane Rita, who's the second of the greys, and Getaway North is over to that one's inside as they now come to the fence, which will be the last next time. What's the scoop taking off just in front? Two in second place on the outside, Aro Branco, with a close up in third old timer. At the back of the field, Hurricane Rita is already receiving some wake-up calls from Jockey Connor Brace as they gallop on down past us. And there at this stage is only seven or eight lengths or so between first and last. So it is What's the Scoop for trainer Sue Smith leading them away from the enclosures to in second place. Quite close at this stage, Old Timer and Aro Branco. They're being followed by Bleu et Noir, the Welsh Raider, up along the inside of Dakota Grey. And Buyer Beware, who's won here at Catterick Bridge before, on the flat. That horse right around the outside in the blue colour jacket with the yellow stars. As they race left-handed now into the back straight, what's the scoop from Old Timer? And then comes... On the outside, Aro Branco, Bleu et Noir is racing next with Dakota Gray, and then Buyer Beware from Elixir, and Getaway North, and two lengths away in last place is Hurricane Rita, as they're now squaring up to the first of the five fences going down the back. All over that stage. 115 at Newbury, there is a stewards inquiry. Defi Sacra first past the post, but there is an ongoing stewards inquiry at Newbury. Back to Catrick. Hurricane Rita barely lifted a leg there in last place, a rather slovenly sort of leap, and gets uh, another reminder as they come now towards an open ditch. They're past halfway. What's the scoop? Just in front from an improving elixir in the sheepskin noseband up around the outer. With in behind them, Old Timer, and then Aro Branco. Bayer Beware is now working hard on the very wide outside and is falling back. In behind Bleu et Noir, Dakota Grey and Getaway North, and Hurricane Rita is uh, toiling in last place. So on they go towards four out. The last in the back straight, Elixir to the outside of what's the scoop. Further down the field, Dakota Gray was lacking fluency as they prepare to swing left-handed out of the back straight. So it is what's the scoop under Danny Cook. Elixir and double-seeking Lorcan Murta up towards the outside. They are head-to-head. -head. They're two lengths away from Aro Branco in third. Then Old Timer, who's now shaken along for the first time, racing in fourth place with Bleu et Noir next in the white. Then follows Getaway North, the winner likely to come from one of these six. They're in line for the final three fences. Elixir down the outside of what's the scoop. Away to the outside is Aro Branco, who's coming into it well, having had a very long layoff. Further the back to Getaway North and Bleu et Noir as Elixir now takes over clearly as What's the Scoop back pedals. At the second last, Elixir was much faster through the air. Bleu et Noir went in fifth place, blundered terribly, and that one has its chance erased as they make the run towards the final fence. Elixir has the advantage here under Lorcan Murta, switching inside is Aro Branco. Oh, and Elixir clobbered the final fence hard, and that's allowed Aro Branco a big opportunity now. On the right is Aro Branco. Elixir trying hard to get back on terms, then Getaway North and What's the Scoop racing into the final 100 yards and it is Aro Branco a fine training performance this by Nigel Hawk the horse has been off the track for a long time but returns with a win back with a bang Aro Branco beating Elixir in second back in third getaway north and in fourth what's the scoop 673 days off the track Aro Branco wins under Connor Farrell for Nigel Hawk handicap chase debut Aro Branco the winner at 9-2 at Catrick Leopardstown very shortly but new